If you ask any parent about their worst nightmare, they will answer without hesitation that it is losing their child. This pain never goes away, and no parent should ever endure such a horrible tragedy. My wife was dead, my daughter was dead, and I wasn't sure how my sons were gonna make it. Sadly, sometimes it does happen. Death doesn't care how successful or wealthy one is. It just arrives claiming the most important person in their life. Today, we take a look at the celebrities who lost their children through tragic circumstances. Keanu Reeves. Keanu, barely called the humblest man in Hollywood, has gone through a series of personal losses in his life. One of those was the loss of his child. In the late 90s, Keanu met Jennifer. The two instantly fell in love, and soon Jennifer was already pregnant with their first daughter. Sadly, the child they were so eagerly waiting for was born stillborn after eight months of pregnancy. The strain put on the couple's relationship by the grief was believed to have resulted in their breakup several weeks later. In 2001, Jennifer tragically died in a car accident. Speaking years later with Parade Magazine about Jennifer's passing, Keanu confessed, grief changes shape, but it never ends. People have a misconception that you can deal with it and say, it's gone and I'm better. They're wrong. When the people you love are gone, you're alone. Sylvester Stallone. When a parent loses a child, there is no greater pain. This agonizing loss will be felt for the rest of our lives. Sage was his first child. And as the actor himself put it, the center of his universe. It's being friendly to people, you know, because being Stallone's son, they expect you to be, you know, this, this punk, man, this, this spoiled, you know, idiot. And you're not. 36-year-old Sage was found dead by a housekeeper in his Los Angeles apartment. The young Stallone, who was reportedly engaged, died of a heart attack. In his first media appearance following the tragic passing of his son, the actor stayed strong, saying it was a horrible situation for all of them, but expressing hope that time would heal the wounds. Sylvester and Sage did go through a rough patch in their relationship after his divorce with the boy's mom. But years later, Stallone managed to restore it just to lose his son again. Joe Biden. The 47th vice president of the USA has faced a series of tragic deaths in his family. In 1972, Biden's wife and their one-year-old daughter were killed in an automobile accident. Melia was driving with their three children when suddenly their car was hit by a trailer. The couple's sons, Hunter and Bo, suffered minor injuries, but both Nelia and Naomi didn't survive. But the call said, my wife was dead, my daughter was dead, and I wasn't sure how my sons were gonna make it. In 2015, Biden lost Bo due to brain cancer. Pierce Brosnan. Handsome, talented, famous, with an incredible family. When the last part of this equation gets shattered, the others don't matter either. This is what happened in the life of Pierce Brosnan. He suffered the first of a string of devastating tragedies when his first wife, Cassandra Harris, lost her battle with ovarian cancer. Years later, in a tragic development, Charlotte, who was Pierce's adopted daughter, died at the age of 41 from the same type of cancer that took away the life of her mother. And just last year, I held a hand of my funny wonderful daughter Charlotte, before she too died from this wretched inherited disease. Charlotte, the mum of two herself, passed away days after marrying her partner. Heartbroken over the horrifying story repetition, Brosnan would soon have to face new sad reality, this time related to his adopted son, Chris. After spending years trying to save Chris, who got hooked on cocaine and heroin after his mom's death, the actor had to give up on that battle. Every now and then, you can still come across headlines referring to Chris as Pierce Brosnan's estranged son. Even though James Bond is reserved in expressing his feelings in public, he still speaks honestly about how painful it was to cut Chris off, but he had no other choice. I had to say, go, get busy living or get busy dying. He has my prayers. Bill Cosby. Comedian Bill Cosby, who is currently serving a term in prison over aggravated indecent assault, lost two children, his son, Ennis, and his daughter, Ensa. Ennis was shot in the head in 1997 in Los Angeles while he was on winter break from his classes at Columbia University. 
Soon, an 18-year-old man was tried and convicted of first-degree murder and attempted robbery. He was sentenced to life in prison. The Cosby family received a lot of support, with numerous strangers leaving flowers on the spot where the killing took place. Then-President Bill Clinton personally called Bill Cosby to offer condolences. 20 years later, the comedian's daughter would die from renal disease aged just 44. In her last years, Ensa was known for being supportive of her father during his sexual assault scandal. She defended him, saying, The man portrayed in the media today is not who my father is. The accusations against my father have been one-sided since the beginning. The woman was said to have been buried next to her late brother, Ennis. <laughs>